Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, good evening to you. And part of the story here is the Albight Stadium by night. 60,000 capacity here. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Italy, and they take on Australia. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. And the Italy starting 11. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Leonardo Bonucci plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And the focal point in attack today, Ciro Immobile. And the starting 11 for Australia. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And they kick off here. Aaron Moy, Boyle, moving the ball forward with purpose. Good pressure high up the pitch. Well, we all know what a tremendously talented player Lorenzo Insigne is. What can we expect to see from him today, Stuart? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly... Immobile! Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area. And what about the finish? With such control and technique. That could have gone anywhere, but not with his skill. It's a great goal. And back underway. 1-0 it is. in control of the situation or well, couldn't find a teammate unfortunately and a throw in to come mm. is it going to end up being productive for them well he knew he had to get to the ball and he did 
Chiesa. Oh, managing to beat him. It's wholehearted defending and the concession of a corner here. Taken short. Barella. That's well blocked. Rustic. And Moy with it. Tremendous ball played through. And did well to keep hold of it while waiting for the support to arrive. Superb block. Delivering it. And first class defending, cleared off the line. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. Aaron Moy. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. McLaren. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Not quite the cross he was hoping for. Well, as you can see, Italy have found it difficult to control the tempo of the game here. But that won't bother them because when they win it in deep areas, they've got forward with pace and with numbers. It's been a great counter-attacking display. Well, spot on with that challenge. Opportunity! Oh, incredible save! And he snuffed out any sign of danger. Verassi, defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Aydin Hrustic. Well, he read that brilliantly at the back. This could level it. And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, he stumped it out of there without much fuss. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this. Yes, end-to-end -end stuff, but now they're forced to track back. Cleared away. Immobile. Very quick thinking there. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. He's got the right idea with that pass. Can he take the chance? And he's done it! Parity again! A magnificent game unfolding. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets up, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Whistle then, we're at the halfway stage in this match. Well, we all see Marco Verratti as a consistent contributor, but just has lacked something in this game, Stuart. Well, it's been one of those days for him. He hasn't had that much of the ball, and when he has, he's given it away. Without his creativity, I'm not sure they get a winner here. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect.
Aydin Hrustic. Well, that pass easy on the eye. A matter of keeping his composure. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Giovanni Di Lorenzo. Read it superbly to take back possession. McLaren. No possibilities in the centre. Not really the ideal clearance. Moy firing it towards goal and a body in the way but a crucial intervention inside the box Federico Chiesa racing forward trying to catch them out Immobile well a classic example of how to intercept Barella Now Verratti, this could be the equaliser, oh great block, Verratti, determined defending, Jamie McLaren, what can they do from here, and with that the attack fizzles out, And support available. Chiesa. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Well read to win possession back. And offside. Well, close one. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Jamie McLaren. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Moy. Could be! And saved by the keeper. Domenico Berardi. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. And the attacking options appear plentiful. Berardi. Jorginho and the keeper more than equal to the task well what a fantastic save that was he'll certainly be grabbing the headlines if it stays like this Barella and on to Di Lorenzo he's showing good defensive judgment Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities. Still possibilities. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Counter-attacking, very much an option. The cross is on. Well, it fizzled out. Well, there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. Jorginho. Immobile now. And the final whistle has sounded. It has gone the wrong way from an Italian point of view here, Stuart. 
Well, Derek, what a good performance this has been. They came in as underdogs, but they fully deserve to be in the next round. They were excellent. Well, we're picking him out for a reason. He's had a tremendous game and attack, Stuart. Yeah, good performance and a really critical goal to give them the lead. They just couldn't cope with his movement today.